students of class 5th today we will study our third chapter in social study that is movement of the earth and their effects students before moving to the further topics let us just recall the previous ones there are eight planets in our solar system and the earth is the only planet in which our survival is possible the earth is spherical in shape and the model of the earth is known as globe so today we will study that how our planet earth moves and what are their effects our earth spins on a particular imaginary line and that imaginary line is known as the axis and the second motion of the earth is that our earth moves on the fixed path around the sun and that fixed path is known as the orbit the spinning of the earth on its own axis is known as rotation whereas the movement of the earth around the sun on the orbit that is known as revolution students let us understand more about rotation rotation is the movement of the earth on its own axis the world rotate means turn so we can say the earth slightly rotates on the imaginary line that joins the two pole and this imaginary line is known as axis yes i am talking about this red color line which you can see on your screen and this line is joining the two poles so it is known as axis students it is important to know that it takes 24 hours to complete one rotation students we all know that one day has how many hours yes it has 24 hours and we all know that day and night together makes 24 hours so we can say that the effect of rotation is causing the day as well as, as well as the night now students i hope there is a question which clicks in your mind that is how day and night happens yes it happens by the process of the rotation let us take the example for the more understanding now let us understand that how day and night happens students let us take one interesting example look at this ball the side of the ball facing the torch receives light while the opposite side remains dark students we will apply the same example while understanding the topic of rotation that how day and night happens all right now while the earth rotates around its axis we can see half of its surface towards the sun my dear students the portion that is facing the sun receives light experiences day and the portion which is in darkness experiences night if the earth did not rotate what will going to happen the areas experiencing day and night would be permanently fixed Dear students revolution is the movement of the earth around the sun on a fixed orbit that is known as revolution the effects of revolution is that it causes season students now let's see the movement of revolution as you can see the earth moves around the sun in an elliptical orbit students this means the movement of earth around the sun in an orbit is known as revolution my dear students it is very important to know that how much time it takes for one 
revolution. It takes 365 days, that is exactly one year for completing a revolution. The revolution brings the colorful spring, the very hot summer which is full of fun. It also brings the autumn in which the leaves fall to the ground and the revolution brings the very cold winter which is very frosty. Now students let us understand about leap year. The earth takes 365 days 6 hours to complete one revolution or we can say that one revolution is equals to 365 1 by 4 days. Students, this 1 by 4 is added every year to the month of February and after 4 years, February has how many days? It has 29 days. Now students, let us take the example. We have taken 2012 to 2016. We have got how many 1 by 4? We have got 4 1 by 4. We will add all these. We will get 4 by 4. After that, we will make it in the simplest form by dividing 4 by 4. We will get 1. Now, this is equals to 1 day. Now, this extra 1 day is added to the month of February. So, after every 4 year, February has 29 days instead of usual 28 days. And that year has 366 days. Such year is known as the leap year. My dear students, I will tell you one of the easiest way to see whether the year is leap year or not. Let us take year 2016. Now, if the particular year is fully divisible by 4 without leaving any remainder, then it is said to be a leap year. Students, here 2016 is fully divisible by 4 without leaving any remainder. So, we can say that it is a leap year. At last, just have a little recall about the whole topic. There are two movements of the earth. The spinning of the earth on its own axis is known as rotation. Now, our planet earth takes how many hours to complete one rotation? It takes about 24 hours to complete one rotation that is equal to one day. The effects of rotation is that it causes day as well as the night. The second topic we have studied is the revolution. Revolution is the movement of the earth around the sun on an orbit. It is known as revolution. The earth takes 365 1 by 4 days that is 365 days 6 hours to complete one revolution and after every four year it comes a leap year that is equals to 366 days. The effects of the revolution is that it causes the variation in the seasons. There are how many seasons? There are four seasons. They are spring, summer, winter and the autumn. Alright students, now I hope you all have understood the topics. Keep on doing the hard work for attaining the goals in your life. All the very best to all of you. Thank you.